Hello, my loves. How are you? Hope all is well with you. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. You guys, I got a little story. Um, here's one. <laughs> this is the little boy. Um, I found him on the side of the road. And the other one is over there being a mouth. And that's a little girl. And um, I found these guys on a busy rural route. Um, they usually do about 50, 55 miles an hour down there. And I found them on the side of the road. They were running in the middle of the road and stuff. And I, with the heart that I have, I could not, not call the SPCA or something. So I called into the garage. I was on the bus. I called into the garage and I told them that I have these two little kittens that were on the side of the road. And I said, I can't leave them here. Could you call the SPCA? Here's the other one. That's the little girl. And uh, I said, you know, I can't see them get hit. So I called back in about 10 minutes later and they still hadn't called. So I called my father and um, my father hadn't gone into work yet. And so he came up and got the kittens and I went over to his house and got them and brought them to my house. And I am so attached now that guess what? They're staying. So, but anyway, here's the little girl. So if you guys can think up some names um, for them, um, put it down in the comments for me because <clears throat> I'm kind of struggling with names um, of these kittens. But anyway, um, I want to get to your readings and this is for my Taurus. And this will be for September 20th through September 26th. We'll see how well they do in here. So, but they're so, they're so adorable. And they're, I figure they're about five weeks, about five and a half weeks, maybe six weeks at the most. Um, Cause they still don't have their molars in yet. So they're not very old, but. I don't know if somebody left them on the side of the road. There was no houses around there. Um, and I just can't. There's no way I could leave them on the side of the road. I am to have too much of a heart. And I couldn't go back. I drive that route every day. And I couldn't go back and see them hit on the side of the road. It would break my heart. So, so I just had to bring them. And I looked around for other kittens in there. I didn't see any other ones. So I think somebody probably dropped them off, which really makes me angry. I don't, you know, I just can't see how anybody could do that to an animal. But some people are like that. So, but anyways, this is going to be a reading for my cancers. And this is going to be for September 20th through the 26th of September. So let's give these a couple more shuffles, guys. So but yeah, they're, they're joy. And my other cats, they're not really hissing too much at these guys. Um, they're more hissing at each other than they are at the kittens. So, but um, the dog is taking a liking to him. Um, he's been playing with them. So, and he's really good, good with them. So, which is really nice. So angels, guides, and spirits, tell me what Cancer needs to know for the week of September 20th through the 26th, please. Angels, guides, and spirits. But they're such little sweethearts. One's a boy and one's a girl. So, but they are. They're just absolutely adorable. And the little boy that is the orange one, and he just loves to give kisses. Loves to give kisses. Okay, let's see here. What do we have? We have the wreath. And the wreath is all about a gift. So it's showing a gift is coming your way or you are going to receive a gift of some sort. We have a man. And this is all about a masculine influence or a man or if you are a man, it could be you. Um, so maybe we have a gift coming from a man. Maybe there's a guy, somebody that we really um, are attracted to 
and we um, want them to ask us maybe to go out on a date or something like that. But this um, clover is also good luck and prosperity is coming. So we have that gift and we have that prosperity and that luck. And we have the cemetery. And the cemetery is all about peace, right? It's about that tranquil place. It's about another realm. We have the moon. Oops, sorry guys. Moon's all about your dreams and your wishes. So I am really feeling that this has to do with a love interest of some sort. Um, we have the harp. Right? And the harp is all about that peacefulness again. Right? That harp is all about peace. It's about love. It's about that serenity. Um, that that, what do I want to say? Um, that beautiful things, right? Beautiful things are going to come your way with this harp. I just feel as if that, that beautiful, beautiful feelings are coming. And then we have the fish. And the fish is all about abundance. I see the fish is abundance. Um, I see the fish is your emotions. Um, so it could be, it definitely has to do with love, guys. I just feel, feel that it has to do with some kind of a love interest that you have been looking at or wanting, and it's going to finally come your way because we have that knowledge, we have that learning, right? So we've learned about maybe this person and it's somebody that we really want to have in our lives. We want that, that person in our lives. We want to take that next step. Okay, so that is what I have for you guys. So let's ask the universe. Universe, is there anything that you would like to tell my cancers? What is it you want to tell my cancers or have them work on this week? What is it for the week of the 20th through the 26th, please? Sorry, I keep looking down at the ground because these little ones are in here. And they were taking a nap, and I so rudely woke them up and brought them up here. And as I have one climbing up my leg. What are you doing, little one? All right, so universe, what is it that my cancers need to know for the week of the 20th through the 26th, please? We have fairies for earth magic. So we have that look. We have that um, magic that's coming in. So that person that we're looking at, we have that magical bond with that person. And we have shape-shifting. So we have the clouds. So we have um, shape-shifting, I think, is looking into ourselves, looking into what we want and what we need. And it looks like you're going to get it. You know, it looks like this week, maybe that new interest, that new love interest is coming your way. So I hope this helps you guys. Um, if it does, please give me a big thumbs up, guys. Don't forget down in the comments, um, put some names down there of some kittens um, for me so that I can pick a name for these little ones. Um, I love you guys. If you have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button for me also. It would mean the world to me. Love you guys. Hope you have a wonderful and a beautiful week. Um, Till next time. Bye, guys.